Hey guys, so I'm in Istanbul airport and I'm on the way to PWA Israel, PWA Tiberias. And I thought this was gonna be a happy video where I'm like, yeah guys, I'm on the way, almost there. But unfortunately, I mean, packing up and all the flight to Istanbul to transfer to Tel Aviv was great. And the baggage uh, didn't take too long to check in. But once I arrived here, I saw a message from PWA saying that basically for some reason I'm not going to be allowed to enter Israel tomorrow at least. Today, I left on Friday, so today now it's like 12, 12 a.m. Uh, Saturday. And for some reason I cannot enter today into, into Israel and apparently I need to wait till Sunday afternoon to be able to fly to Israel. I don't know why I need cannot arrive to Israel earlier than Sunday So the situation is <laughs> kind of surreal um, Basically my flight is delayed to Sunday evening. So it's like 30 hours more than 30 hours from now 36 hours from now now by then my COVID test is not valid anymore. So I need to leave the transfer zone, pass passport control, do another COVID test, then go into the city to or like somewhere nearby to find a hotel, stay in that hotel for 30 hours and then come back to the airport to board my flight on Sunday and yeah, at least the gear should stay in the airport so wow <laughs> Even for me, it's kind of a surprising turn. So guys, now it's Sunday evening. I'm finally here in Tel Aviv, finally landed here. Um, yeah, it took a while uh, with some issues due to permits. I had to spend two days in Istanbul. Uh, but now when we finally came here, we got like a super VIP treatment. We're currently in a VIP terminal. We didn't even have to touch our bags. So yeah, amazing organization uh, to greet us here in Israel. Uh, when we came here, unfortunately, uh, the event is starting tomorrow. So basically, and it's already like 11 p.m. Uh, so it means I'm not going to get any training done, which is for the result. I'm not going to lie, it's horrible. It's going to affect uh, the, my performance a lot. But yeah, there's nothing I can do about that now. So just have to focus and do the best uh, I can tomorrow. It's also, I'm only going to see my equipment tomorrow morning. So hopefully none of it is broken. So yeah, see you guys tomorrow. Hi Enrico. Hello guys and welcome to Tiberias, Israel. We are at the event spot. But once I arrived, the treatment was amazing. We got greeted in VIP terminal with some really nice ladies and uh, yeah, made it to the hotel last night. Unpacked today. So here is uh, how I live together with Mr. Ingmar. <laughs> Yes, yeah, so this is how it looks. Everyone has like, each two people have like a single uh, space like this and it continues over there. As you can see, all the way there. And the entry into the water is right here. And the event area is this. So as you can see, it's a lake in between the hills. And yeah, it's pretty beautiful around here.
started around a little bit uh, before three o'clock and the wind was super, super gusty to start with. So we started with foil and 7.7 and then at some point everyone shifted down to 7.0 small medium or 7.8 medium and yeah actually was like one of the best racing days I had uh, since I only arrived yesterday I thought yeah I'm just gonna be relaxed you know I didn't have any training so I'm putting no pressure on myself and just going to do the best I can and uh, that's what I did so you know I, in every heat I was concentrating on just like you know doing a good start, keeping consistent pressure, and eventually doing a good job. And I managed to go through one heat, then into the round of 32 quarterfinals, qualified out of that heat twice, because um, the first time after I finished in second or third, the heat was canceled after I finished it. Uh, but then I started again and managed to win it. So was super happy about that and went into the loser's final and managed to take sixth place there. All in all, an amazing day for me. And I can only hope that I can continue sailing like this for the rest of the event. But yeah, realistically, you know, some bad things can happen when you race, you can make mistakes and none of that happened today. I was pretty lucky in all kind of ways on the water. So yeah, I'm looking at it in a realistic way. And I believe that I will get some lower results in the future, but I'm going to try to get some better ones as well. Let's go and talk with the guys around here. How, how was the day for you? It was quite hectic with a gusty wind and hard to decide to which gear you t should take. Yeah. Oh yeah. God. <laughs> no, run, no. run. I don't want to be on camera saying that. So. Best day ever? Yeah, best day ever. I think before today, yeah, my best result was like a ninth. Yeah. And I just got a fourth. Amazing. So I'm pretty stoked. What, yeah. For what? me, I like it to be powerful. Yeah, yeah. Um, we race a lot with the boys at home, so you have to be you have to be on the big sails. How many times did you sail that one hit? <sighs> I actually don't know. <laughs> More than twice? Hey, uh, two general recalls, a resail, and then the final, I think four. Four. And I was so broken by the, the end. the final one where you finished the, the best one of all? Yeah. I had like, I just changed what everyone else did. Everyone else went for the boat. So I just went for the, for the pin Amazing. and just, yeah. Congrats. Cheers. I would like you to introduce you to my friend, Pirat. <laughs> <laughs> my friend, <laughs> Pirat <laughs> Tibone. <laughs> so he, he, he sorry, sorry. No, no, I, 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 I start to jibe and I realize like I had Antoine on my ass, so you kind of focus. I jibe and then I see the nose of a Patrick board coming like this. I'm like, holy fuck. <laughs> Luckily, we both didn't fall. You fall? No. Yeah, but we kind of stopped, but okay. it's okay. My friend Pirat. Sorry. But, uh, no, no. A pretty tricky day. There was lots of stops and starts and things yeah. going. Bit, Did you get uh, some, um, what was like kind of the most emotional moment that you caught on camera? I think it might have been Matt check over there. After, <laughs> after what? <laughs> 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 <laughs>